his pre-draft process, especially at the combine, is going to be huge because you have to really understand a lot of the, there's a lot of questions. You know, what happened when Brian Kelly got there? What happened this season? Uh, you know, in, within your offense, what happened postseason? You know, with you deciding to come come back, but also then deciding to declare. And it'll be interesting to see if it's a lot of they, 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 he, 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 or a lot of me, 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 I, I, I. Because if it's me, 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 I, 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 I did this, I made the mistake, I did this, I was, you know, X, Y, and Z, then that's a good sign. But if he's deflecting to everyone else, then that's a bad sign. So his, I think more than anything, no one has really altered their draft stock more this year at that position than Keyshawn Boutique. 